a story, uh, and uh, we'll lead into uh, to how you are going to, dare I say it, change the world. <laughs> Students and the community gather as UTP held their last 2013-2014 Distinguished Speaker with the host of Bill Nine the Science Guy at the Fieldhouse April 1st. Bill Nine is known for his show, Bill Nine the Science Guy, which aired from 1993 to 1998. Nine talked about Earth's climate change and how carbon dioxide levels have increased. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Using his token humor to discuss the topics. You know, Mr. Nye, we don't use sundials to tell, th it's the space program for crime. Bill, I see you're wearing a watch. No, it'll be cool. Come on, people, we can reckon time on another world. It'll be like those guys who speak Klingon. I thought it was great, to be honest. Um, Bill and I, I mean, I've seen that guy's show since I was growing up. And he's actually part of the reason why I decided to become a scientist. So it was just great you know, seeing him in person after so long. He's an older guy, but he can relate to the younger generation as well, which is what I think makes him a great a science teacher, basically. I like how we talked about global warming, um, because it is a very important issue in today's society, but a lot of people are denying that it is happening. Um, I think that is mostly due to lack of education in science. I don't think it's so much people you know, distrusting scientists or just flat out denying it. I think we need to be better educating the public in that area. Pope Gregory the 13th was so powerful, yes, how powerful was he that he declared the 5th of October to be followed by the 15th of October, throwing away 10 days. Bill also talked about how the world's population size has more than doubled through his lifetime, from 3 billion to 7 billion. Also how carbon dioxide increase is also harmful for the environment around us, and a history lesson on his parents. I th it was great. Um, it was something different than we usually get. Bill and I, it was awesome that we, that we actually brought him down. And it was awesome that it went past the time and he wanted to keep on going. I think that was the best thing about it, that he wanted students to keep on asking questions, the community. It wasn't just him coming down just to make a speech and go off. He wanted people to ask questions to him. And I was just trying to spread knowledge to everybody. I actually always bring this up in an example is that the Super Speaker Series brought Neil deGrasse Tyson, I want to say four years ago. And at that time, I wasn't able to go see him. And I, I regret it, because I could have. I was, at, I was in high school, and I wasn't able to do it. But now, Bill now came, I wasn't able to do it two years ago, but I did do it this time, and it was great. He had a good message. I'm just really hoping that it motivates students, mo motivates the community, the youth, to keep on going and striving for excellence. And with your brains, my friends, you can, dare I say it, <laughs> change the world! Thank you all very much. For more videos, subscribe to the Pan American YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, and follow us on Twitter. For the Pan American, I'm Michael Aguilar.